you guys what is up it is ivy concrete cat walk those of you who are new to my channel welcome i love all things fresh, vintage new nearly new estate sailing sailing you name it i love it to make hot walk welcome back to a new video this sunday those of you who are newly subscribed thank you so much for coming along together on this journey so as you saw from the title is it gucci enough i am going to be reviewing with you a bag that was sent to me from an entity called dodo top this business does dupes reps and you guys know i review them if they ask if i'm willing to review i will select the bag and i will kindly do the reviews maggie the owner of dodo top reached out to me and asked would i do a review of one of their handbags now you guys know i do not do the unboxing portion because the idea is to get right into the bag so without holding this up the bag is the gucci soho pebbled leather medium sized handbag and i'm gonna hold this up so you can see the bag that is the authentic piece the bag that i received was sent by way of usps and travel time to me was fine it took about seven days for the bag to get to me full tracking information was made available here is the box that the bag came in it has your magnetic clothes and when you hold it up it says gucci on the front the bag did come with the ribbon and also with its card and paperwork in the box the bag also came with a dust bag the dust bag to me was not necessarily uh, in line with Gucci, but nevertheless, it came nicely protected. So the bag that I received is this beauty right here. The Gucci medium-sized Soho tote bag coming by way of Dodo Top Reps is an all leather piece. Now I'm gonna hold this up and I'm going to turn this around. I'm gonna show you the bottom as well so that you can see the bag in full. The straps to this open up so that you can extend the bag out if you have to get into the bag for your goodies. I didn't put anything in this bag because I wanted to feature this so that you all could see everything. It is a pebbled leather. If you look at the bottom of the bag, there are no feet. You look at the corners, you look at the side stitchings. The bag is put together very well. The handles attached to the D-rings, very spacious and roomy on the inside. Now I'm gonna pull out what I have stuffed in here, which is the dust bag and the plastic that the bag came with. So I'm gonna hold this up so that you can see that it says Gucci on the inside. It is the one zipper pocket on one side of the bag, the zipper pocket. And then on the other side of the bag is two slip pockets where you could put phone or you could put compact, you could put money, you could put credit cards if you needed to. Now the bag is very spacious and it is very roomy. And of course you have the leather hang tassel that you can take off if that's not your cup of tea and you don't want that hanging from the bag and you decide you wanna do otherwise, it is very easy to remove. It's just a cross through piece. And then of course you have the leather tassel here and then the GG's, large GG, which is the color of the bag, which is a black. And then of course the grommets here and then woven through so that you can do this. If you chose to wear it or you needed to shorten the strap for whatever reason in order to gain access, these move very easily. It's no issue with trying to decide how to maneuver inside of the bag. It opens up very wide. 
you can get things in here if you had an iPad, if you had a couple extra things. You could even, even get flip-flops in here if you were going to get your toes done, etc. And you needed to go on the run with this bag. You absolutely could. Now, as far as the dimensions of the bag, it is running close to the size of the authentic bag. One thing that I will say about this bag is the simplicity of the bag, I think is absolutely beautiful. If I were in the market for a bag like this, if it was gonna be a piece that had logo on it and it was larger, I would opt for something like this because it blends in just nicely. And if you wanted to turn it and wear it where the logo was not visible, it's very easy to do. This bag versus the authentic. There are some slight differences with this. Would I say that this is a one-to-one -one rep of the authentic Gucci Soho tote? No, I would not say this is a one-to-one. -one. This is a great piece. However, there are some things that are a little off with the bag and it's no disrespect to the maker entity of the piece, it's not. I would say that as far as the coloring to the chains, on the authentic piece, the gold chains are a little bit more paler yellow. They're not a, a on the deeper side yellow that these are. And in my view, real time, these have more of a, a more yellow side than a more paler side of yellow that you would find on the authentic bag. And also at the bottom, the seam on the authentic bag is a little bit different versus what's on this. And as far as the handles go, I believe that the handles on the authentic piece, the D-ring shape is a little bit, I want to say maybe a little bit smaller, a little bit tighter than this. But I would say overall, as far as a bag that you wanted to add to your collection, and you didn't want to go in the direction of looking for the authentic piece, but you wanted something close, this would be a great dupe to pick up. As far as what I feel about the bag, from one to 10, where does this bag fall? I would actually give this bag a five and a half to a six out of 10. And the only reason being is because this is not a one-to-one -one, and there are certain things on this bag that I think would trigger that it is not the authentic piece. Not to say that there would be anything wrong with carrying this bag, because there wouldn't be anything wrong with carrying this bag. If you're not concerned with the fact that it's not a one-to-one, -one, some people do not want a one-to-one. -one. They don't want a mirror image. The bag is a nice piece to choose if you want something that is not going to be super expensive for a replica. This would be the way to go for you to get a Gucci Soho. The other thing that I want to share with you that came with the bag that I absolutely really love was in this bag. And I'm gonna show you my ears, a pair of gold Gucci earrings. These earrings are tremendous. They have a lot of weight to them. And to be perfectly frank, I absolutely love the earrings. I think the bag is beautiful and I like the bag, but I absolutely love these earrings. And if you were interested in getting these earrings, you could go to their site and you could look for these earrings or you could use the discount code, if you're interested in purchasing the Gucci Soho bag, you can use the discount code VConcrete20 to go and purchase the bag. And you also receive these earrings, these Gucci, these Gucci, I'll call them on the smaller side, hoop earrings, GG earrings, absolutely free with your purchase. For those of you who are cost conscious and you don't want to break the bank on a replica piece, I would say that this would be a great way to go. It's, if you're interested for the money, this will get you closely to where you are trying to get to. Beautiful bag, 
all those things withstanding and I think that you'd be very comfortable if you wanted to carry something that was subtle, simple. I want to carry the Soho Gucci-esque bag. This would be the way for you to go. You guys, if you are interested, I am going to leave all of that information to go to Dodo Top's website in the description box below. So take a look around their site. They have plenty of offerings. They are exceptionally nice. Maggie, thank you so much for sending this bag and the earrings that came along with it. If you have any questions, you can send Maggie communications directly. You can contact her via WhatsApp. That information again will all be in the description box below should you be interested in this piece or take a look at their accessories because these earrings are absolutely tremendous. I absolutely love the way these look in my ears. So you guys, there you have it. That is my review of the Gucci Soho medium sized leather tote. If you do not want to miss out on anything that I post, you know what to do. Like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I post videos every Sunday. So if you do not want to miss out, tap that and you'll receive notifications each time I post a new video. Links to my socials will be listed in the description box below. You can head on over to Poshmark. You can check out my closet. I am Concrete Catwalk on Poshmark. If you see anything there that you would be or may be interested in, please feel free to leave me a message there or head on over to Instagram. You can DM me there. I am the Catwalks Concrete on I. G, if you see anything in my Poshmark closet that you are interested in. You guys do not forget the giveaway is wide open and will be until Sunday midnight, November the 10th. You have up until then to make up your mind about which one of the handbags you are interested in. You can go back on my channel and look at the video talking about those two things that are a part of the giveaway if you are interested. It is very simple. We do not make this complicated here. Like, comment, subscribe, leave me a comment as far as which bag you are interested in. And you are off and running into the giveaway drive. The two lucky winners will be selected Sunday, November the 17th. Guys, thank you so much for stopping by this week. Be safe. See you all next Sunday. Bye for now. Get a hold of yourself.